This is Cerebral Cinema. Movies of the Mind. You stay close to me, Hermie, no matter what happens. Yeah, I will, fella. Now don't move around. I, I, I don't hear anything now. Well, something's nosing around outside, crawling up over the plane. I, I guess we're all right with the door locked. Maybe. Reggie. Yes? Didn't you know one of the windows is open? What's that? Sunny opened it just a little crack so we could get some air in here. Now I'll have a look. Well, come along with me. I wonder what it is out there. Hold it. <laughs> yes. Here it is. I guess nothing could get in that. <laughs> nothing bigger than a June bug. Hermie. Huh? Hermie. Little one with the white skin. She's calling me. Well, that isn't Sunny. No. It's the girl who jumped off the ledge with me and kissed me. Well, the female vampire? Hermie. You hear me? Uh, don't no. answer. No, I won't. I, I, I don't like her anymore. Little boy. I have some nice, ripe figs for you. What is she saying? Figs? Uh-uh. She gave me figs the first time I saw her. Uh, listen, Hermie, I'm going to talk to her, but you keep quiet. All right. You do not need to be afraid of me, little boy. You're quite right about that, miss. Ooh. You heard me? You are not dead. Do I sound dead? No thanks to you, however. But I did not do it. Well, somebody did it. And give me a bad case of tonsillitis. Where are you, anyway? I, I can't see you. Sitting out here. On the wing of the plane? He. Still perching around on things, I see. Did you fly over here from the temple? Fly. That's what I asked you. I am not bird. Well, you seem to get around like one. You will open door and let me come inside. No? No. So? I'm more apt to take a pot shot at you with this revolver if I get sight of you. Where is Hermie? Over in the temple, I guess. That is not true. So you say. No. Manuel, take only the girl. No, so it was the priest chappy. See, I don't want the girl. I want Hermie. Why? Why? Yes, why do you want him? He has nice white skin. Now, you should see my skin sometime. So? That's right. Underneath my shirt, I'm as pink as a spank baby. That is very interesting. So what has Hermie got? I haven't got. Hermie is little boy. He is there with you, is he not? I told you he isn't here. But I know he is. You still haven't told me. Why do you want him? You do not know about vampires? Uh huh. So you admit you're a vampire? I am high priestess of vampires. Yeah, I know a museum that would like you. Museum? Yeah, that's right. Stuff. So? Believe me, they would love you. What is this stuff? <laughs> Never mind. You wouldn't like it. Are you alone? See. Si. I just about have a notion to come out there and pick you up. I am not afraid. You open the door and I will come in. What do you mean, that? See? It's a deal. You will. You've got yourself a proposition. Climb over the door. Reggie, you're not going to open the door. You keep back. If I can capture her, then maybe we can trade her back for Sonny. I wish you wouldn't. Now, don't worry, we'll make out. You crouch down in the corner here. I I'm a Hey, You've got to be a man about these things, Sammy. Besides, I'll shoot holes in anything that bothers us. Now, keep quiet now. Now then, uh, where are you? See, I am here. The door's open. Come on in. It is difficult. Reach out your hand. I don't see you. This way. I, uh, uh, now then. No! The noose. Put it about his neck. Make sure this time. Richie! Reggie! I'm here, little boy. No! No! Go away! Go away! I will hold you very gently. Gently. Let go of me! Put me down! Put me down! Come. Our task is done. I don't want to! I don't want to! I don't want to! Oh. Look here, Doc. And this is how they swing from ledge to ledge. Swing? Yeah, sure, swing. Look look at this vine rope tied to one of these hooks in the wall. Vine rope? Well, spank me for a baby. <laughs> Will you look at that? It must reach clean up to 100 feet in the ceiling. Uh, that's it. The rope's fastened in the center of the ceiling. They just swing from the ledge of one wall to the other. But, Jack, 40, 50 feet above the floor. That's maybe Tarzan. Yeah, it must be more than one of those ropes, too. Must be. The she-vampire, Manuel. Boy.
Grove with a hop and on off the ledge last night. And the girl carried Hermie in her arms. And hanging on to the rope. As strong as not. Well, your arms would develop in short order if you did much of this monkey stuff. Monkey stuff, no fool. I'm a slope of hair with the greatest of ease. Well, now we can get across to the other ledge. Yeah, you don't mean it. <laughs> Why not? You mean you've got the nerve to jump off this ledge on that rope? Will you tell me how else we're going to get across uh, the sunny? If sunny's over there. You know she is as well as I do. Yeah, I reckon I do. Well, I wish you didn't. Well, we're wasting our time. You mean we're going to do it now, son? And you think of any better time? It's a plain dark. And I can't see all the fresh air that's below me. And you can't see where you're landing, even. I'll well, have to chance it. Jack, I'd rather make a blind airplane landing in the Grand Canyon than to try and hit that ledge over yonder in the dark. Well, I can only try. Now, wait a minute, fellas. Doc, this is getting us nowhere. We've got to get to Sunny. Okay. Then I'll do it. You crazy idiot. You and me both, fellow, but if you can do it, so can I. This is my idea. Now, look, son, I have to knock you cold like I've done last night. I was just thinking of the same thing. Oh, so you want to wrestle for the privilege of committing suicide? Act like you had some sense, will you? It's just as much sense for me to go as it is for you. Doc, high places don't bother me. Me neither, fella. What you think I'm yelling about? There ain't nothing I'd rather do than swing out on that rope. That's so. Sure, it's so. <laughs> Things I used to do in my father's barn when I was a kid in Texas makes this look like child. Uh-huh. So, seeing I've had experience, hey, turn that darn flashlight on my Yeah, like swinging on a rope 50 feet up in the air, do you, huh? That's what I say. Well, why are you gripping that door jam of that cell so hard for? Just hanging on, I mean. I know what you mean. Just the thought of swinging through the air makes you uh, squeamish. Now, look, Jack, I'm taking a lot from you. Yeah. Yeah, if you're in a maiden, then I'm scared. Uh, You're no more scared than I am. I hate it. It just happens. It it doesn't make me sick to my stomach. Who's sick to his stomach? You are. You're green around the gills. Tell them fighting words. Shut up. Would you turn that place so quick for us? Look over the ledge. Down on the floor. Well, son of a gun. Another torch light parade. Oh, they sure do a heap of sacrificing down this country. Yeah. Second time tonight. Quiet. Quiet for a minute. Can't hear them shakers they use so well up on this high ledge. Wonder if it's the only kind of music they like. Doc, do you see what I see? What do you see? There's a girl leading the priests. Well, I'll be a small detail. Do you suppose that's how the ranch will be a vampire? Uh, Doc, it isn't the body of an Indian man this time. Ain't got anything on the loincloth, no matter who you Jack, isn't that a little kid? Yeah, he's alive. Look look at him fight. They've got him gagged. Well, were we going to lay here and watch him sacrifice a little kid? Yeah, he's alive, all right. And he's going to stay alive for my money. Wait, 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 wait. Look how white his skin is. That doesn't make sense. Any kid's skin is white. But it, that isn't an Indian kid. That, that's Hermie. Hermie? Jack. Look. Look what's happening. They're not taking him down into the underground passage. The girl's taking him. Hey, the priests are going down underground without him. Uh, he's coming this way. She's bringing him up the stairs. Well, let's go get her. No, no, no. She's coming up here. Jack, if we lose Hermie without lifting a finger... Don't you get it? She's got to come up here. She does? Why? This is rope. This rope, she's got to come up here to a rope to swing across to the other ledge. Why, now, ain't that a brave process? Well, she'll probably come up on these steps a lot faster than we could, so keep quiet. But she can see in the dark. She's here before we even know that she's around. Yeah, I forgot that. Quick, into the, into the free cell. What about the rope? If we can't hurt her, she's liable to get away before we know she's here. I fixed that. I tied it up out of her reach. Now you're talking. I hold it. Jack, how'd you get her, me, and where's Reggie? I was just wondering. Quiet. You do not be afraid, little Hermie. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. Do not struggle in my arms. Angelina, don't move. So? Keep the flash on her, Jack. Get between her and the stairs. With pleasure. Now then, put Hermie down. I will not. Don't try to be clever. Put him down. Never. Doc. Yeah. 
Go up and take Hermie out of her arms. You do not. You make one move and I'll shoot you dead. Go on, Doc. Von Spons, I'm doing you. You keep back. Oh, so? You come one more step and I throw little boy over the ledge. Yeah, no, you wouldn't. Yes, I will. What about that, Jack? Uh -huh, she knows better than that. <laughs> yeah, but does she? Yeah, she's a dead pigeon if she tries. Listen, you. I'll give you to the count of three to put that child down. And if I do I'll not... I'll shoot you dead in your tracks. And if you do that, little Hermie and I will both roll off the ledge together. <gasps> Hi, Jack. That's dangerous. Be careful. You won't give up the boy if we let you go? No. Well, looks like we're licked, Doc. It does kind of look like it, doesn't it? Might as well put up your gun. All right. See, that is better. Get her! Get her, Doc! You bet! Oh, no! No! Put her up! Oh. Keep him! All right, hang on to Hermie. I got him! Pull her off! Here, pull, pull, pull her into the priest cell now. And Get on her! As strong as a bag of cat! Yeah, here we go. You dare touch the high priest then. Now lie still. She bit me and scratched me like an animal, Jack. Jack. Never mind. Get Hermie's gag off. Right about Reggie. Yeah, wait a minute, Hermie. Uh, Here, little uh, fella. Uh, oh, I, I, I want some clothes, Jogger. I, I want some clothes. Never mind your clothes. Where's Reggie? They hit him and put a rope around his neck. Dangling? Doc, get back to the plane. Leave you here? Don't argue. You've got to save Reggie. <laughs> Cerebral Cinema hopes you have enjoyed this movie of the mind.